Hey guys, it's Lexi and I'm here to do a quick haul with you. Obviously quick because I just need to throw this together while my husband is watching my kid. So, um, if you're new here, hi, welcome. Thank you for clicking. I am a reseller. I go thrifting. I buy things from people that don't want it anymore and I sell it to people that do online for a profit. Um, if that's something you're interested in, if you want to learn how to be a reseller, click subscribe and I will give you some hints and tips and show you what I buy and show you what sells and just have fun because reselling is fun. So anyway, we're going to get right into this so that I can get back out there and hang out with my family, which is a huge perk of being a reseller. Um, so this was all purchased in one day, um, yesterday actually, at my Goodwill's $2 pants sale. So I guess they got a lot of stuff from, if you don't know, this is 2020 and the pandemic is happening. Um, so anyway, I think they got a lot of stuff donated from people who were cleaning up and cleaning out during the quarantine. And so they had three days of sales this week. They had um, Tuesday was two dollars tops, Wednesday was two dollar pants, and then Thursday today actually was two dollar dresses, which that is a haul for a, another time. I didn't get to go to the tops because I was working my like day job, um, but I did hit up the pants. And uh, so yeah, any pants in here for two dollars, and then I'll let you know how much the other stuff was because of course I bought for stuff. All right, so let's just get going. This is exciting. Oh no. <laughs> this is exciting because I kind of forgot what I bought. Um, okay, so we've got brand new with tags, old navy athletic. This is the Elevate legging, which is my favorite. I'm actually wearing a pair right now, but not the sculpt ones. Um what, what are you doing? What what are you doing, camera? Okay, there you go. So um no, see I, I didn't plan this out because now where do I put it? Okay, we're good. Okay. <laughs> so, um, these are nice. These are some Athleta pants. Um, and they are just some nice, like, uh, I, I can't even tell, describe it. What is this material? It's like athletic material. It's not like a windsuit, you know? Anyway. Thank you. Okay. Um, I found a lot of Torrid jeans and if you're new to this channel I love selling toward this is size 12 just a nice pair of boyfriend distressed boyfriend jeans these are also new with tag and I have a love-hate relationship with stitch fix because I can't seem to not pick up when I find new with tag stitch fix but then they don't always sell but these are nice cut with the cut from the cloth y'all I'm lost right now cut from the cloth straight leg plus size 14 pants denim black denim pants new tag okay this is is this the title nine ones yeah so this is the first time I found this brand it is title nine and it is athletic wear this is um extra small um leggings and they're like a brown color and then they have a pocket on the leg which I think is so nice um I don't know and then this leg is like this like I, I don't know what to call them like are they because you know I want to call them yoga pants but like that's not a thing now it's like flared leggings <laughs> but these are like yoga pants with a key Why you? one sec hey baby go back with daddy yeah. Close the door for me. Thank you. Sorry about that. I have a three-year-old. Okay. These, of course, were not $2 because they're not pants, but I couldn't pick them up, put, put them down. They were $2.50. They're some converse. They're so cute. I really wish that they were my little boy's size, but they are too small. They are um, a six. So, come on, y'all. I actually just sold a pair of kids' con converse today and sent them out today. Uh, these are not pants either, but they are Duluth trading, or it is a Duluth trading skirt, which I think it's a skirt. Yeah, it's a skirt. Um, and it was new with tags, which is why I got it, and it originally retailed for 70 
I've actually sold some Duluth Trading um, new with tag items because I had gotten some in a mystery box. So I have experience and they actually do pretty well. Like all the pieces, I think I had three, they all sold and they didn't sell, didn't take for very long. This is another new to me brand. It is Zuda and it was just in nice athletic skirt um, in really good condition. And of course it's a skirt, just like the other one, you know. So I thought I would look it up and it was a really good size. It's a large. Um, comps looked pretty good, so we'll see. I didn't get to look up everything because I um, had my kit. So, you know, there was some stuff I just threw in, um, like the cut from the cloth, cloth pants. I didn't look them up. Um, Le Tigre? Tigre? Don't even let me. Don't. Don't. I'm so sorry I did that. This is a vintage sweater, though. Oh, it's so cute. If it were bigger, it would stay in my closet <laughs> because I love it. I just love the basic gray and white. I mean, gray and black. It's a really cute sweater, y'all. <laughs> Sweaters are four, four thirty. Okay, and so I couldn't pass this up, and you will see why. <laughs> yep, I I don't. The brand is um, Toltec, so it's like homemade, but like. And then it's bleach dye, bleach, you know, I like it a lot. That was also for something. Um, I'll use them at the bag with no pants. <laughs> okay, so this is a vintage 3X Rustler shirt. Check this baby out. Yep, 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 yep. My mom said it reminds her of Garth Brooks, <laughs> but it snaps up and I just recently sold a vintage Rustler shirt um, a month or two ago. So, and it wasn't that cool, in my opinion, anyway. Okay. Um, oh, this is a, a We The Free, Free People tank, link, boxy kind of high-low. It's cute. This I got strictly because, and it was so cute. This is a brand that can be sometimes at Anthro. I've never got a piece from Anthro, but it's got hummingbirds. It's so cute. And like in the little bottom tanks there are three dollars so i thought it was worth the risk because i liked it um these works a good little surprising find in the plus size section um they're soma new with tags extra large pajama pants um and of course they were two dollars because they were counted as pants and the print is just gorgeous gorgeous gold salacial print so that should do well soma intimates do pretty well for me um i've never tried their non-intimate stuff because hustle at home mom says don't buy anything that's not their like sleepwear so i just follow her <laughs> um this is a fabletics um demi lovato and fabletics which i've never found a one of her their collab pieces um and I didn't even know that it had like a special logo because I saw this logo and I was like, well, that is Fabletics, but like, what is this? And then whenever I looked inside, cause it's at a tag, it says Demi Lovato, hold on. My face off, see it says Demi Lovato for Fabletics. Um, and it is a size large sports bra. So sports bras there are $2 um okay torrid again um where are you yeah okay so this is a really cool top so it's nice and lightweight with this like floral pattern but look at the back i don't know if you'll be able to see it's buttons buttoned up the back like that and it's like it's so cute it's so cute um so yeah it's torrid size one which is an extra large oh this is for me because uh i am a sucker for t-shirts and i like this saying so it just says in this world where you can be anything be kind that's, i'm not i'm putting it in a second that's mine t-shirts there are three dollars 
Look at my wristy, y'all. <laughs> so long. <laughs> anyway, got some more pants. Okay, so got another pair of Torrid denim. And this one is in a size 18, which is a great, great size. Um, I think that they're boot cut. Yeah, they're Lux Slim Boots. And I'm totally okay with buying because Torrid does really well for me. And they were $2. This is another pair of Torrid. This is 18 short, which I love finding short and talls. And this is another boot cut. This one is called, I don't know. It doesn't have the name, like that one had the name on it. But it is boot cut. Couple more things. These are so soft. I don't even know what they are, they are so soft. What are they? Oh yeah, yeah I remember now. Okay, so these are some J. Jill Pont Point. <laughs> Point? Is that what it is? That were there? Point. Um, what does it say? <laughs> Full leg. Pont, is it ponte? Pont, pont, pont? I don't know. I'm sure you can tell me and correct me below. But they're 2X and I got them because they were new with tags and the original price was $100. These things are so like soft and stretchy and like, you know, the cuff bottom, like, <sighs> They're very nice. All right. I think I know what the last two things are because I haven't gotten to them yet. So I've never sold this brand in anything but dresses. So I've sold like three or four dresses. They always do well. Um, it is Toad and Co. In case you didn't know, they used to be called Horny Toad. Um, they switched that to Toad and Co. This is their extra small and they're just like some like jeggings I guess like legging pants those are gray and they're in really good condition both pairs because I've got another pair and these are um called the flex time skinny pant toad and coat it's got it's got an actual horny toad on there these are size two um, and these are really nice. Like they feel almost like outdoor pants, which they might be because I think it's like an outdoorsy brand. Some nice, a nice zipper pocket. Um, but it definitely has that texture and like, look at the knees. They're like, um, like reinforced knees. So yeah, that's what I got. Um, where did my RC go? So I'll tell you like, Y'all, I'm a mess tonight. Okay. So I bought all of these things. And I spent $65 with um, tax. Uh, tax was a whole lot. It was like $6. What? I'm not even frank. What am I doing? Anyway, how many items did I, I bought? 21 items for $65. That is not bad at all. Um, it says I saved $28.90. So if I would have just purchased all these things on a regular day, then I would have spent $100. So that's great. Um, would I have bought all of these had it been a regular day? Probably so. I don't really know if there's any in there that I would have passed on. Um, even the old navy leggings, like they're going to sell. Um, new with a tag, old navy leggings, every time that I found them have sold pretty quickly. Because, I mean, I literally am wearing old navy leggings right now so i think they're kind of sought after people know what their size is they know which ones they want and they don't want to pay store price and they don't want to wait for a sale so they come to poshmark or ebay so anyway thanks so much for hanging out with me while i showed you my haul um please comment below if you know anything about these brands if there's anything you wouldn't have picked up um if you've had a sale recently where you got a lot of stuff if you just want to say hey my husband works at Seiko too. No, just kidding. Okay. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. Subscribe. Thumbs up. I'll see y'all later.